Tempered glass lid shattered, giving me Schrodinger stir fry. Hey, just let some of the glass slip into the food. It'll give it that extra crunch. What do you mean your mouth is bleeding? Saw a post about an unknown bug bite. Thought I'd follow with my own. Yo, I don't know what bit you, but that foot is swollen. Don't go walking barefoot in the forest. People are gonna see your footprint and think Bigfoot was there. Dropping a medical injection worth $12,000 on the carpet and bending the needle. Wait a second, that's $12,000 worth of medicine? You can't just let that go to waste. I don't know how you're gonna get it into your bloodstream, but you better find a way. That's $12,000. Why just break one ankle when you can break both? You see, this person's an innovator. They're not just breaking bones, they're breaking records. This is some like life motivation stuff. She was probably doing some awesome performance. They were like, break a leg. And she was like, oh, you know what? I'll break two. Kudos to her. And, and also uh, get well soon. Yeah. <laughs> Brand new box of nails forgotten outside for four days. Yep, and now they're all rusty. You effectively made all these new nails look as if they are 25 years old. I was about to head to the gym. Ah, oh, having broken headphones are the worst. I ordered chicken wings for dinner and I got a box of only veggies and sauce. Ah, oh, they did you dirty here. I can imagine there's just a vegan in the kitchen just like, <laughs> vegans one, meat eater zero. Had a martial arts competition on Friday, but I decided to faint at the exit of SeaWorld, causing me to break my jaw and have to get 10 plus stitches. Yo, that's one of those freak accidents that just makes you say, man, I'm never going to SeaWorld again. Guess who ran out of paint? Hmm, I wonder who. But if anybody asks, just say that this is one of those artistic, you know, works of art. Yes, you see, I left this area of the wall blank because it, it speaks to that one empty spot I have in my soul. And then you just gotta hope that everyone believes you. Local liquor store went under and left this note. Thank you for the 10 years of support. P.S. We're drinking the rest. Wait, I'm sorry, how was that a well that sucks incident? These guys are gonna have a good night. Mother Nature decided that this BMW should be a convertible. <laughs> well, I, I, I mean, yeah, but also, couldn't you argue that Mother Nature also decided to make this car, well, you know, unusable. I mean, you're definitely not going to be able to drive that car anymore, but hey, free convertible. My mom ordered a TV delivered by FedEx for me for my birthday. We just opened it up and turned it on and, and what? Does it work? Ooh, try starting up Netflix. Stainless steel, two weeks old. Ah, uh, yes. You see, this is the specific type of stainless steel that, um, has stains? Went fishing, caught two branches in a row, went to take a sip of my Arizona, except there was a bee in it. Aw, your first kiss. Now this one's going in the photo album. No, but seriously, this bee took pow right in the kisser. Way too seriously. Ordered a Gromit coffee mug online. Hey, well, all they did was promise they would print Gromit's face on a mug. They didn't say it would be your mug. All right, you just gotta read the description. No, no, in all seriousness, you got scammed. That sucks. What am I gonna do? I have about 70 bites on my legs, going a steady 10 bites a night. No one in my house knows what is biting me. Oh my gosh, these bugs are menaces. Yo, just sleep with pants on. Matter of fact, just put on a suit of armor. You definitely deserve to be protected. Last coat of varnish, and a moth decided to do a dive bomb. It was a kamikaze mission, but it successfully destroyed the aesthetic of the table. Mission accomplished, moth. Mission accomplished. Having to throw out $50,000 worth of frozen items at work. Oh, uh, what? Why? I would have totally eaten that stuff. Matter of fact, where's the dumpster for all this stuff? I'm asking for a friend. Had a sandwich from the market wrapped in the deli like they wrap meat in the meat department. Didn't grab the sandwich one this morning. Hey, you know, that's better than a sandwich. Who needs the good old classic peanut butter and jelly when you can just eat raw meat? Like in the olden days. And by olden days, I, I pretty much mean cavemen. Eating that in the lunchroom would definitely get the coworkers' attention. Unknown insect bite. That's not an insect bite. Your forearm's just pregnant. Congratulations. I hope it's a boy. Bought my first house and it came with a shed. Turns out the previous owner wired the shed himself and rewired parts of the house. Oh no, th this does not look like the work of an electrician. I would not touch that thing. I'm craving pizza, but I convinced myself to get groceries and make a healthy dinner instead. Why do I even try? Uh, yeah, no, that's that's definitely not fresh. But hey, you got it for 69 cent. Nice. Yeah, you might as well just call up Domino's now. Left my husband alone for five minutes while painting. Uh, honey, I made a mistake. Uh, but good news, the kid's floor is now a green screen. Am I an amazing husband or what? What, what do you mean we're getting a divorce? The people who have to deal with this need a raise. Aw, uh, now that's just not cool. That's not even funny. That's just messed up. I don't think that's how an exhaust should look like. Uh, what do you mean? It, it's perfect. No, but in all seriousness, you're going to want to get that looked at. And shame on you, Carl Smith of car sales. How could you sell him a car like this? I guess you could say that this exhaust has me exhausted. <laughs> yeah, I, I know. It's, it's not funny. I, look, guys, I didn't make you click on the video. You came here for the bad jokes. 
jokes. But for real though, I'm sorry if my exhaust jokes have left y'all tired. <laughs> See what I did there? Uh, okay, yeah, next meme. Haven't driven my car since I last got groceries. Found the missing milk under the seat. It rotted for several days. Ah, don't you just love that new car smell? And by new car smell, I mean the smell of rotten milk. Yeah, you know, honestly, I would just scrap all the upholstery. Just pay to have it all replaced because yeah, that, that's not going away. I had a toothache and it turned into shingles. Fun stuff. Tooth still hurts. Oh, uh, I can imagine, dude. That That's tough. Found a living black widow in my organic grapes. Aw, oh, no, the vegans replaced their meat with vegetables, and now the meat eaters are putting spiders in the vegans' food. When will the war end? When will the violence stop? My uncle rode his motorcycle from Florida to New York. Just before he got to my house, his phone slipped out of his pocket on the highway. Well, does it still work? Like, what's the update? Dude's probably grabbing his phone like, Siri, Siri, talk to me. Dinner, dinner. I'm sorry, I can't go on. Aw, oh, come on, Siri, don't give up on me. Dinner, playing, never going to give you up by Rick Astley. Never gonna give you up. Never gonna, okay, what is this tangent? Can we, can we keep going? I'm sorry for wasting your time. First thought it was rice on my garbage can, but after a closer look, they were moving. Oh yes, this happened to me a lot growing up. You see those right there, those are maggots and they are the most disgusting thing to have to deal with. You know what, just get the bleach and drench your trash can in it. That's the only way you're gonna get rid of them. Either that or just buy a new trash can because honestly, this, this is bad. Didn't realize until halfway through eating that these chocolates had legs and are ants. Huh, Captain Crunch is really changing up their formula. Charging my JBL speaker before leaving on a beach trip when it blew up. Hey, well JBL always said that they had some fire beats. They don't call it a boombox for no reason. I was in a middle seat and paid extra money to upgrade to a window seat. Hey, well you got a seat where a window would be, but you didn't get the window, yeah. Uh, I hope you can get a refund, but seeing as it's an airline, you're probably not. Doesn't that just make you want to say, geez, well that sucks. <gasps> oh, I get why they call it that now. The neighbors cut down the shade trees in my yard without permission, and now I have to look at their ugly ass garage, which was not visible before. Aw oh, man, that's awful. You know what you should do? You should sneak into that little shed and rewrite their circuitry. That'll show them. I didn't have my period for three months. Now I get it on my wedding day, along with the worst cramps I've ever had. My wedding is up in the mountains. Oh no, that's terrible. What an awful wedding that's gonna be. Here comes the bride. Oh no, she's crying. Are you okay? Drilled into a sprinkler pipe and soaked every apartment from mine to the fourth floor down. I can imagine the construction worker was just like, no, I don't need a stud finder. I'll just drill into the wall. What's the worst that could happen? And the answer is this. This is the worst that can happen. The box said 3,000 pieces. A week of quarantine tells me it's 2,999. Oh, Oh, it's such an intricate puzzle and then yeah you just have that one piece missing in the back you know I can't prove it but I think the cat did it yep hey my son ran into your car with his bike sorry about the scratch oh yeah cuz this is totally how you deal with property damage hey sorry man I, I broke your laptop I was doing tap dancing on your desk and you know things just got out of hand anyway see ya it's like you don't just leave from that that's so messed up I'm an idiot and my wife won't stop laughing at me oh buddy buddy <laughs> <laughs> okay, this is a fair laugh. You deserve to be laughed at for this. I wonder if this is the same guy who poured paint on the carpet. Something tells me that they might be the same people. The current heat wave has caused my glass table to explode all over my freshly painted decking. Mother Nature is just having a fit. They're just destroying everyone's stuff. Yo, Mother Nature, you good? Just got home with my new shoes. About to go for a run. Yeah, you know how some people say you dance with two left feet? Well, now add running to the list because yeah, one of those shoes is just not gonna work. Made something special for a guy I was hanging out with slash seeing for a couple of months. I just finished it by the time he got cold feet and ghosted. Sharing here since I won't be giving it to him. Aw, that's such a pretty piece of artwork. You know what? He didn't deserve your aloe vera plant. You can do way better. <laughs> Anybody would be lucky to have your paintings. Screw that guy. Well, actually don't screw him because he's a bad person. You get the point. My mom regularly works 70 hour weeks and tomorrow she has a day off. She bought a bottle of rum to relax with tonight and my cat broke it two minutes after she got home. Aw man. Now I know some people are gonna disagree, but this is why dogs are better. I'm just saying. It's my birthday and I'm spending it alone. Cheers to 22. Okay, but let's be fair. All birthdays are special, except for 22. 22 is just such a boring age to turn. 
one. Like, it, it's still a big deal and happy birthday, but honestly, what what is there to celebrate? You can already drink, you can already do that. It's kind of a mid-birthday anyways. Maybe next year. And hey, at least you got to keep your alcohol. I know some cats that have been trying to take that bottle out. My boss's secretary quit this morning after delivering breakfast. Oh, what a way to go out. Like, I'm sorry that they quit, but if they were gonna quit, this has gotta be like the most epic way to do so. Taking a bite out of every donut and then just leaving it there. Not gonna lie, I, I know we're in the, you know, sick people times, but I would totally eat those donuts. What, you wouldn't eat those donuts? What are you, some kind of weirdo? They look so good. Cat went under my covers to throw up. Aw, why? Why would you have to do it like this? You have a litter box, you have other places to throw up, but no, it has to be under the covers. I know I've said it before and I'll, I will say it again. Remember, a cat did it, not a dog. I'm just saying, just saying. Losing your glasses while rock climbing. You're gonna die. It's that simple. You're gonna die. There's no way around it. Especially if you're, if you're uh, <laughs> not close sighted. Oh boy, you're you're a dead man, dude. You shouldn't smoke inside the house. But I love it how at peace he is with the fact that his house is on fire. He's just like, yep, should have emptied out the ashtray. Decided to go sit on the beach for an hour a few days ago. Managed to get sun poisoning so bad that my elbow doubled in size. Mate, how did you not feel that? Like, I know you can't feel sunburn sometimes, but sun poisoning. I've had it. You can feel it, bro. Also, I like how the guy in the spacesuit is now like looking like he's getting burned by the sun. My shorts ripped while cycling to work. I live 15 km slash 10 miles away. Bro, I did this in high school, let me tell ya. Little bit of duct tape inside, little bit of duct tape outside. Boom, you're embarrassed all day, but at least you're not showing them your butt. I went commando the day it happened. Yay, ketchup finger time! Yay, ketchup finger time. So, there is now a new building outside of my window. Goodbye sunlight for the next four to six years during college. I only have one thing to say. Yay, capitalism. Guess who found a pile of horse crap at the park? Oh no, little buddy. Did he get pooped on and roll around in it? I hope he didn't get pooped on. That would be so much worse. Some fortune cookies contain no fortune. Thanks. The one part I look forward to after Chinese is the fortune cookie, and you give me this. I'm lost in life without fortunes, man. After eight hours of work, my flask slipped out of my hand and shattered just before I could purify my product. Ooh. Bro, I'm so so- wait, what are you cooking? Is this an episode of Breaking Bad? I don't think it is, but still, that sucks. Someone at USPS tried to fold my package with a rare record inside it. A hundred dollars gone and now one less of them in the world. That really sucks. I don't know what record this is, but also, bro, this might be your own fault. One, go to UPS or FedEx. They're a lot more personable with your package. And two, it, do, put do not fold on there in the big red, red writing. It costs nothing extra, and I don't know, maybe put fragile on it otherwise they're just like whoosh, whipping it against the wall i'm not even kidding they broke my youtube plaque when i hit 100k on my personal channel arizona problems left my credit card in my car and it melted dude i did this in florida my capital one card i left it on the hood and i picked it up and it just kind of like flopped over and it never worked right again it was so funny i still have it in my desk on the first day of my trip to washington dc i got hit by a car bro when i first moved to florida my first week i got hit by a bmw coming out of a hotel the saddest part was not the bruise on my side that was actually pretty cool looking it's the fact that they got my skateboard broke and didn't want to pay for it but they did in the end because the wife knew i was probably 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 really hurt and could have sued him remember action park their water slide just caught on fire <laughs> Sweet, man. It's just as safe as it used to be. At my apartment, you need a key fob for entry. Only problem is, I forgot the key inside. I walked out and let the door shut behind me before realizing he wasn't outside yet. Now, we wait. LOL. <laughs> I was gonna say climb it like I did with my old apartment building in Los Angeles, but yeah, you're not climbing that, dude. Hopefully the dog can jump up and be like, doop, open it for you. My car this morning. Bro, what a dick. That looks like an undercover cop car. Um, politics aside, I'm all for destroying those electric scooters, like this called uh, trashing birds, because that's what people call them, and I love whipping them into trash cans and shoving them into trash cans, but don't break people's cars. Warning, my computer is too old to run Minecraft 1.17+. plus. You will need to buy a new computer to continue playing the higher versions of Minecraft. Awesome. Let me just, yep, still broke. Um, 
Well, it was fun playing Minecraft while it lasted. So much for being the next dream. Water resistant to 330 feet only, not 1mm on the shower shelf. It's a very strict rule apparently. Dude, that really sucks, but water resistant does not mean waterproof. I used to go through watches all the time when I was in surf instructor in Florida because like that I always buy the $12 water resistant ones. My friend's lunch. That just sucks, bro. That just sucks. I don't know what else to say. Living in Arizona is like, thermometer is crapped out and in the shade and it's still spring. Yeah, it is capped out and uh, let me just tell you, that's Arizona for you. It gets so hot the tires melt on the road, I'm not even kidding you. Brand new roll of wrapping paper wasn't quite big enough to cover the box. Too late to go out and get more. Hopefully, he won't see it. Just pretend there is wrapping paper here. It is a big box, okay, don't judge. <laughs> I tried, okay, thanks, bye. I like how sad the note seems. They tried so hard and got so far, but in the end, it doesn't even matter. I thought I was having a bad day until I drove by this. There's a bridge in Metuchen, New Jersey, that this happens to like at least once a month, and it's freaking great. My mom used to work into an office right next to it. So I had a sneezing fit while driving yesterday, and oh, that sucks. That's why I'll never buy a super nice car. It's too much to fix. If I did this to my 97 Honda, it'd still run perfectly perfectly and of course i just leave it because it's not worth fixing today is my lucky day uh I, I don't think so bro i i think today's not your lucky day and it looks like you got a black eye what is going on there so the roofers went to the wrong home this morning uh that's on them if you gave them the right address this legit happened in florida and like they wanted to charge the lady to f <laughs> to put back on her own roof they ripped off and she's like no you ruined my roof and then they had to replace it for free Going to medical school in the US, about to be another 126,000 more on June 25th, and you can't even go to class in person. Fun fact, did you know college in the US is 10 times more expensive, adjusted for inflation than it was in 1977? Because the generation before us didn't pay back all their loans. Is this where the gluten was? Yes, yes it was, they just scooped it on out of there. Also, don't drink Arizona, man. That stuff's filled with sugar. My air conditioner stopped working for a few days. My house got so hot and humid, it sealed my entire Costco-sized case of envelopes. That really sucks, my dude. That really sucks. I don't know what else to say except rip your envelopes. Get it? Rip? Because you gotta open them by ripping them. Got home from work, ready to have some blueberries and wine, and then the bag broke. Dude, and the blueberries are now blueberry wine. Look at it that way. Just like scoop those bad boys up and five second rule. Five second rule, my dude. Ordered wings for lunch, banana for scale. <laughs> That's beautiful, man. It's like they chose a baby chick. Oh, that made me sad. This tree hit my house last night. Maybe, um... Yeah, it's not that bad. It, it only broke the roof, dude. Stop complaining. It didn't go through your house. Red Robin has pizza now. But when you customize the order, it defaults to no cheese and no sauce. I didn't notice until I got home from curbside pickup. Mmm, bread and cooked pepperonis. <laughs> Okay, who in their right mind was like, yeah, this order seems right. Let's not call them. They just want bread and loose cooked pepperonis. What is going on here? Marquis decided I'm not going anywhere to die. Yeah, you live there. You live there forever now. You're not leaving. Um, it was nice knowing you. You're going to starve to death. Plane crashed in a buddy's backyard. I would be ecstatic for this. You know why? You could sue the heck out of somebody and what'd you lose? A couple of steps and a few trees? Yeah, man, I'm all for this. Hopefully the pilot's alive, but either way, I'm all for it. Unbelievable. Just just run it over. What's wrong with running it over? I, I actually don't know. I, I've never mowed a lawn with one of those push mowers, just like the ones that weren't battery powered or gas powered. But like, I just ran it over with it, man. <laughs> Didn't think I had to assemble the ball. Uh, yeah, it's a special bowl. Welcome to 2021 where you gotta assemble your bowls because we don't have the materials to do it ourselves. Okay, um, sorry, um, I accidentally threw your parcel on top of the roof. My apologies. Uh, use maybe a broom to get it down? How did you accidentally throw that on the roof? I mean, thank God it looks like it's a shirt or like a loaf of bread, so it should be fine. But like, how, dude? No collision or vandalism. The window just decided it didn't want to be part of the car anymore. Uh, no, this fell off the track. Usually, like, there's two screws that hold it in. Either your screws broke or just a little clasp at the bottom broke. That's, that's just how it works, man. I may or may not have mistook this for toothpaste this morning. Oh. Mmm. <laughs> The toothpaste tastes a little ultra white today. 
like petroleum jelly. <laughs> Thought I was smart ordering a 90 degree cable for my cell phone holder. Yeah, you thought, buddy. You who thought. Kids decided to prank me by hiding a permanent marker along with a set of temporary tattoo ones. Peter Griffin will be with me for a while. <laughs> That's not Peter Griffin. That's crackhead Peter Griffin. We need to get this on crackhead's Craigslist. Close because someone spooked on the floor. <laughs> I thought it was going to say someone stole our stuff, but no, it's someone pooped on the floor. <laughs> you know the person who had to clean it up had to make this note. How does this even happen? What? How? I, at least the rubber seems to be sealing it a bit, but how does that happen? I know it's metal in the handle, but still. If someone's missing an extra large Allen wrench, I believe I may have found it. Huh. Yeah, um, <laughs> that's a nice Allen wrench you got there. You quick, use it to fix your tire. <laughs> Found out what my concrete steps are actually made of. Dirt. Sweet. Freaking sweet, dude. You won the lottery. You got some free dirt. Wife helped me put sunscreen on. She's a keeper, my friend. She wanted to make you look like zebra. So much for Sandai Bumdai. Oh, no. <laughs> Not the socket wrench kit. Floating cafe near where I live just sank. Um, yes, I'd like an ice mocha latte with light foam, extra shot of espresso, extra light ice, and, uh, can I get a blueberry muffin? Glug, 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 glug. I'm drowning, dude. Come on, man. I, d d no, you can't order. Started my internship today. Squatted down to get my phone and my pants ripped. Bro, that's not an issue. Like I said, get the duct tape. My house is flooded with sewage. I told the landlord about this teeny leak two days ago, and the repair guys were supposed to be here this morning. Well, now you got a poopy apartment and your landlord's gonna have to pay for that my friend just to let you know he has to pay for that if it was caused by his negligence just trying to wake up is hard sometimes sometimes life is just against you trying to wake up and go to work you know what that means go back to sleep get fired and live the rest of your days a hobo like i plan to do one day i'm glad i hide my feet firmly on the ground while this happened otherwise <sighs> Uh, no, 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 no. See, there's always videos of this stuff online. Those things actually go down as a safety feature so you don't get one up the butthole. I mean, it might be a good time if you like it up the butthole, but usually they have some safety measures so that this doesn't actually go up the poop chute. The moment when you get home, open the bag and realize you're a, <laughs> you're a dummy. I did this with my mom the last time I went to Staples. She asked for Staples and I bought paper clips because the box said Staples. I'm this idiot. Guess I'll order out tonight. What? What are you talking about? What? You don't like a little bit of glass in your food? Come on, it gives it that good crunch. The construction worker who worked on the sidewalk is probably having a really bad day, but somewhere out there, there's a kid who's having an even worse day. I mean, can you imagine face planting onto concrete? You're gonna be walking home looking like Han Solo when he was frozen in carbonite. Seriously, that is just so unfortunate. My mom was just finishing up cleaning the kitchen and then spilled a bag of chia seeds on the ground. Aw, no, just when you think your cleaning is done, it's like, oh, Oh, grab the broom. We, we got a mess to take care of. My sister tried making popcorn at work today. Didn't go very well. Jeez, how do you mess up making popcorn so bad that you have to call the fire department? Like, that's not just burnt popcorn. No, that is inferno popcorn. Jeez. Looks like your sister's definitely not getting that raise anytime soon. Mold killer in the bathroom is itself moldy. I hate this flat so much. Yep, uh, definitely time to move. I personally, you know me, I hate mold. So the fact that even your mold killer has mold on it is just so sad. It's like, if you can't beat them, join them. Oh, what's that? A key identification card. Oh, that must come in handy. Oh, oh yeah, no. Not when all the keys are on the floor like that. Yeah. Yikes. I thought I bought forks. Yeah, no, just because they put a picture of forks there doesn't mean you bought forks. What? Why would you think that? What are you, some kind of weirdo? No, you bought 24 plastic spoons. <laughs> <laughs> Enjoy eating your spaghetti with spoons. A bird crapped in the open mouthpiece of my coffee. <laughs> oh no! You have a freaking sniper pigeon just ruining your coffee. Matter of fact, ruining your day while we're at it. I mean, you can't even like take a napkin and wipe that off. No, you're just... <laughs> 
I guess you gotta get a whole new coffee mug. That sucks. Chilling in the bathroom with my parents and my cat during a tornado warning. Hey, I don't know why this sucks at all. It's some good family bonding time. Plus you get the cat too. Like, come on, it's a good bonding experience. Uh, yeah, let's just hope you don't lose the house. Although the dad does look pretty upset. He's like, man, I know we should have put a TV in the bathroom. Anyone else have to remove the washer agitator because they washed a new box of staples or, or is it just me? How do you accidentally wash staples? I mean, I I'm sure there's like a logical explanation, but gosh. See, this is one of those types of damaged things that you you can't even hire anybody to fix because they're going to ask you. They're like, how'd you break it? And you have to tell them you put staples in. <laughs> Oh, you played yourself. This pillar was straight last week. This is the first floor of a seven floor building. Oh, it, it used to be straight. So, so the structure is kind of crushing itself. Yeah, have fun trying to not think about this when you're trying to work. Talk about distractions. I wore shorts to work last night because it was 75 degrees out. This is what it looked like outside this morning after my shift. Yep, 75 degrees one day and then absolutely snowing the next. Where is this, North Carolina? Seriously, mother nature is just like picking the random wild card when it comes to weather. Ooh. Ooh, yep, I, I hope you're in the mood for bananas because yeah, all of those are open and now you have to eat them all. I traveled from the United Kingdom all the way to Germany to take photos of the devil's eye, but when I got there, oh no. So there's expectation and this is reality. Ah, no. <laughs> Hey, well, it's not too bad. You know, maybe with like Photoshop, you could, yeah, no, it's ruined. I'm sorry. Late to work, shut the fridge door too hard, knock the bottle of wine off the fridge and hit my coffee. Needless to say, it was a bad morning. Jeez, did all of that spill or is this a crime scene? <laughs> I'm sorry, this is perfect for the subreddit though, like, cause, cause this, this is just so sucky. Bird crapped on my window while it was open and it got splattered on my bed. Aw, oh, no, ew. What is up with these birds and just attacking us humans? We're just trying to live. And the birds are like, no, you must be uncomfortable. Drove a four hour round trip to see an active volcano today. This was while I was on vacation. Hey, what can I say? You gambled and you lost. I love how the sign's like, a summit transformed. Ah, yes, of course. You see, it's transformed into smoke and fog. Hey man, I feel bad for you, but you did go to see an active volcano. I mean, a bit of fog covering your view is bad, but at least you didn't die to an active volcano. So, you know, it's kind of okay. Got a smoking deal on this cable. <laughs> How does that even happen to a charger? Like I heard of lightning fast. I never heard of like smoldering fast. Definitely don't know if I'd charge my phone with that one. Galapagos rock formation, Darwin's arch collapses from erosion. What? No, <laughs> no. <laughs> No! <laughs> got it delivered vertically. I still ate it. Eight out of ten. Oh, I really hope you got some like discount on that because honestly, that looks awful. Wait, hey, wait a second. Is that a pizza with shrimp and oysters on it? Oh, you you're a sick man. No wonder you ate it vertically. You're <laughs> you're a weirdo. Taking my food to bed was a bad idea. No, 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 no. Dropping your food was a bad idea. Eating in bed is not the problem. No, you're the problem. Apparently, I have alopecia now. Oh, Oh, now that actually is unfortunate. Like this is not anything somebody could have done to prevent this. It's just, this stuff happens. I mean, it sucks, like plain and simple. There's nothing more to say about it. Although what I will say is bald is pretty freaking cool. So, you know, if you shave your head, I mean, hey, wouldn't be the worst look in the world. That's all I'm saying. You know, bald is beautiful. Just look at Mr. Clean or Hitman 47 or any middle-aged suburban dad. Honestly, bald is the new look. I asked my friend to spray sunscreen on my back. Not the most even coat. Hey man, you need new friends. I. <laughs> I don't know what to tell you. They were like, yeah, you know, that's pretty good. Are you sure, man? I, I feel like there's a lot of empty spots left. No, 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 it's gonna be fine. Yeah, well, it's not fine. And now you have to pay for it. I'm, I'm so sorry. Have cats, they said. It'll be fun, they said. No cats were harmed and no plants were seriously injured. Oh, oh no. <laughs> See, if I came home to something like this, I would have thought like an earthquake had like struck the house. Little would I have known that the cats were just ransacking the place. Ah, that is, that is definitely a good advertisement to not get a cat. This screwer crawled in my shorts and stung my balls. Hands down the most painful experience of my life. Oh, oh no. See, now that is some actual scary stuff. I didn't even get stung there and I'm like, oh my gosh. Like I feel the pain for you. If something like this ever happened to me, I'd just put on a chastity belt like, 
a bunch of jock straps, any cups I could put on, like all of it. I would have, I would be rocking my gear. I wouldn't trust anything in the world. Just, <laughs> just cause I mean, this is really awful. It's labeled recycling, but it all goes in the trash. Oh, well we've seen this one before. It's really just environmental awareness theater. You know, they're not really doing anything. They just want to pretend and look like they're doing something. Seriously though, companies should definitely not do this. It's, it's really messed up. I forgot that I don't have an ounce of melanin in my skin and then I fell asleep on the beach for four hours. Oh, Ugh, that is pain. The, the redness, the, the little bumps and the, ah. Uh. Luckily for me, I do have melanin in my skin, so I've never had sunburn. But if I ever did and it was like this, I, I don't know what I would do. I'd be afraid of the sun. Just looking at all the damage to this cause, I'm thinking like, gosh, the sun is dangerous. Guys, we gotta cancel the sun. All right, look at this. It, it's only fair. Found out my neighbor sleeps with a loaded firearm today. Corner of my computer desk right behind my monitor. So basically your neighbor almost assassinated your computer monitor and that's when you know it's time to get new neighbors is it funnier knowing that these are antidepressants no no it just makes it more sad i see a lot of people posting their allergy tests here behold 40 environmental allergies allergic to all of them okay now that is honestly very upsetting i for one am allergic to like a hundred different things and it's nice to know that some people are going through the same issues you know once i get my allergy test i'll take a picture of my back and, and we'll we'll compare but yeah having allergies suck i ordered gummy vitamins vitamins on Amazon and I live in Arizona. Okay, so they might not be gummy vitamins, but at least now you have some pretty cool slime, right? Right? No? No? Yeah, okay, yeah, maybe not. Currently stuck in an elevator in my apartment building. I was told about 40 minutes until tech arrives and I have to pee. Uh, I think having to pee is like the worst part of it all. I mean, sure, you could go in a corner, but then you're stuck there and once they get it open, they're like, oh, you animal. Yeah, you know, it's a lose-lose situation. I hope you're not claustrophobic. No caramel for my eyes ice cream, I guess. Wait, are those ants? Oh, ew. That is like really disgusting. Like I get if one ant gets stuck in there, but look how many there are. You know, everybody touts how like intelligent ants are, but like one gets stuck in the caramel and like the others aren't like, hey guys, you see Tommy got stuck. Maybe we should, you know, back away. But instead of that, they're just like cannonball and jump into the caramel too. Gosh darn those ants. Results from my allergy test. My body reacts to every type of local allergen. Jeez, that is something else. It looks like the doctors were playing Connect Four on your arm. Matter of fact, you look like Killmonger from Black Panther. But hey, at least you know you're allergic to everything, right? My front yard 12 hours ago. Uh, I'm sorry, your front yard? No, no, no. That's your front swimming pool. See, like it's kind of cool. My first day of lockdown in my city and my toddler does this. No, not the TV. Especially because it's the first day of lockdown, which means like you can't even go out to buy another one. Nor can you really bring somebody in to fix it. It's just, it's, it's ruined. See, this is why you shouldn't have kids. Everybody should just never have kids. All right, that's that's the conclusion. My younger siblings destroyed my final from high school fine arts class. See, when something this bad happens, all you can do is sell the idea. You go up to your teacher like, well, you see the tear in the arm is like, it's symbolic of how like we destroy our muscles to then become stronger, you see? And you just gotta hope that the teacher buys it. When you realize it's been a little too quiet in the office lately, 638 new missed calls. <laughs> Oh, somebody's getting fired. That's, <laughs> how do you explain 638 missed calls? I mean, that, that's kind of unexplainable. I mean, I'm sorry, you, you lost your job. Brother was only able to grab his phone. No injuries. Oh, and it's such a nice house too. Like, uh, I feel really bad. Hey, but I mean, at least you grabbed your phone. I mean, all your possessions and everything you care about is in that house, but, but hey, I mean, at least you got your phone. You know, you can download the Zillow app and buy a new house. I mean, that, <laughs> huh, I guess you could say that this knife couldn't cut it. Badoom. <laughs> you see what I did there? Cause the knife couldn't cut it because it broke. <laughs> uh, excuse me, David. Huh? What are you doing, man? What is uh, nothing, this? Nothing. Nothing. I was just trying to make jokes. Dude, no, your jokes are terrible. What? I, I don't think my jokes are terrible. You think my jokes are terrible? What, what are you, you some, some kind, kind of, of weirdo? weirdo? See, I knew exactly what you were going to say. Come on. It, it's stale or, you oh, know, it's, it's on, redundant. Man. Can you just, we'll just, just go on jokes. to the next meme and try and be normal. Okay. 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 Good. Next meme. I just had a whole conversation with myself. Uh, I don't even think I could go back to normal. 
normal, so let's just keep going with the memes. I'm a solar roofer, and we're required to wear gloves while we work. It's only May. Jeez, it looks like you stole someone else's hands and surgically, like, sewed them onto yourself. I mean, that is a next level tan line. Like, gosh. It's 3 a.m., everyone's asleep, and I've been trying to get out of my room for 30 minutes. Oh, no, your doorknob. I mean, you're just stuck. I, I don't know what to tell you. How did this happen? You accidentally turned your room into an escape room. Someone decided to play tic-tac-toe on my car. Oh, faith in humanity lost. Just... Why would somebody do this? It's, I mean, hey, at least they won their game of tic-tac-toe. Someone managed to lose their new box of lost item trackers. Huh, irony. Phone slipped out of my pocket while going go-karting and became wedged under the cart. This is what I found at the end of the lap. So, uh, uh does it work? <laughs> my apartment received a shockwave from a missile that hit my neighborhood. Oh, glass everywhere, the house destroyed. Ah, I'm sorry, that, that is really awful. My phone slipped out of my pocket while I was mowing and I didn't notice until the music in my AirPods stopped. So, uh, does it still work or? Okay. <laughs> Yeah, no, that definitely is not gonna work. But you know, maybe, you know, you take it into the Apple store, they inspect it, and, and yeah, and actually you just lost like about a thousand dollars. I'm starting to think that this view isn't worth golfers aiming directly at our homes. Are you kidding me? Of course it's not worth it. I mean, sure, it's nice to see the big old green field, but you got Tiger Woods trying to assassinate you every time you walk past your window. It's definitely not worth it, that's for sure. When you finally win family bingo and your prize is gefilte fish. Oh, man. <laughs> His soul was crushed that day. Waited five years for this cactus to bloom. Leaving for a five day trip, I noticed this. Oh, oh no, that's unfortunate. Lost my phone at a construction site today. Found it a little later. Ooh. Okay, now that is just the universe said, you know what? You in particular. <laughs> my pizza was delivered on its side. Wh who? I, I can't. Can you imagine being the delivery guy and being like, eh, I'll just like put it on the side like it's an Amazon package. Like, what? My mother took up a haircutting course nine years ago. With just little practice, she confidently lured my brother in for a haircut. This is the result. Ooh, that. Ugh. I'm sorry to say, but I don't really trust uh, her haircutting abilities. Turned 18 yesterday. It is now 12 hours later, and here I am in a train to out of nowhere after being kicked out for not cleaning enough. Thanks, ma'am. Oh, oh no. Left my one month old bike for one night on the street. Well, that sucks. Ooh, yep, that, damn, dude. People are ruthless. Walked into the Cairo for minor back pain. Left in a wheelchair, straight to the ER with paralyzing sciatic nerve pain. I don't know if I said that right, but holy ah. This is like the biggest fear for chiropractors or going to the chiropractor. I'm sure the chiropractors aren't scared because they think they're professionals, but you know. Found this today in a park and ride. Someone is gonna have a bad time when they get back to their car. Oh my god. How? Like, how does, how does no one see that? Headed to the airport and halfway there I looked down. Thanks for the Father's Day gift, kids. The slippers are very comfortable. I guess I'm doing some shoe shopping at my destination. Are you telling me you- I- I don't know how this is well that sucks. Like, uh, if those are the only things you have to wear on your feet, then you, maybe that sucks, but... You didn't notice you put on slippers before you went out the door? I- I'm confused. There goes our precious pie. Oh, that is sad. Boyfriend decided to try out a new hairdresser. Uh, I- this isn't it. Nope, find a new new one. My mom ran over a mattress on the way home and it got caught under the rear driver's side wheel and caught fire. Jesus Christ. Company sent mismatched pieces of my new couch today. They don't make the couch anymore. Oh, that's great. You know, that's that's fantastic. Tornado driven murder branch impales my house directly above my kid's bed. Who? that tornadoes, I, I don't ah. them. Also, anyone else see that, uh, that master sword there? That's pretty sick. My car this morning. Uh, how? What? I, I did someone like just have a temper tantrum and throw the scooter and run off? There's gotta be footage of it, right? Bit down on a bite of blueberry pancake. Uh, and it just, like, sp the, the blueberries, like, splattered? Huh? Ate half a head of broccoli, only to discover it was full of bugs. What? Oh my god, I'd vomit. Holy. Tanned a bit too much while wearing shoes. Kids call them my chimp feet. Ah, yes, I've seen this. It, it doesn't help that his legs are very hairy. Um, but he do be chimpin'. Uh, pimp chimpin'. Worked with concrete without gloves. 
didn't know it's corrosive. Oh, eee, yikes. My fiance was in charge of getting my back. Ah, I see. She did great. Broke my ankle, wrist, and tore my ACL and a tendon in my thumb on my wedding day. Wow. That is, um, a wedding to remember. My friend fell down the stairs in our Airbnb. Ugh, that's gonna be a nice charge for you. <laughs> Yesterday, our neighbor's 80-foot locust tree gave us some live-edge skylights, a great view of the stars and that rainforest cafe atmosphere that our living room had just always been missing. No injuries, dog pissed the bed, life goes on. Ah... Uh... <laughs> That's fantastic. Great. Wonderful. Friend of mine hid my AirPods in a box of chicken nuggets that I proceeded to microwave without opening the box. Who does that? I would tell- I would demand that they buy me a new pair. Peas went in our supply closet? Looks like we forgot to give these out. Ah, I- <laughs> I get it. My fiance's family farm after a windstorm last night. Oh, well it was a farm, that's- <laughs> that's for sure. Trying to catch a cactus that your cat knocked over. Ugh. Ouch. Got home from work, ready to have some blueberries and wine. And then the bag broke. Oh, that is... That's depressing. Ordered a new chlorinator for the pool. The instructions came on VHS. Are you... That... That date... That's not a date, because it's like 2048. But... What? In 10 seconds, I'm going to discover the value of life jackets and renter's insurance. Holy... My freezer broke two days ago and I didn't notice, so now all of the meat we had in it is bad. Oh god, that is th never mind. The wine and blueberries thing, not as bad. This, uh, this makes me sad. In fact, uh, I'm gonna go cry for a second. Okay. Came home to the studio like this. Oh god. That man, they just keep getting what I gotta go cry again. Hold on, I'll be right back. <clears throat> Uh, my AirPods battery expanded and the warranty expires today. The battery also melted the plastic, so now it's impossible to take the individual headphones out. Good lord. You know, people, uh, say AirPods are good and all, but, you know, nothing beats a good old-fashioned pair of, uh, earbuds. Black cab ran me over, dragged my left for a few feet, backed away, and drove off. Oh, Jesus Christ. Accidentally made a magnifying glass when rain gathered on crash wrap covering a busted sunroof. Oh, that's, uh, ugh, that's unfortunate. It could be worse, though. My poor thermometer can't move any closer to the temps of hell. Life in Las Vegas. Oh, man. It's trying its best, man. It's, it's reached its limit, quite literally. So I had a sneezing fit while driving yesterday, and, oh, no, I'm not ready for this. Oh, oh, I was expecting, like, a super disgusting, nasty wind shield, but this is worse. Our entire hotel got seized by police on the first morning of our honeymoon. Oh, I mean, at least it'll be a, a fun story, right? I see everyone's Legos for all time and raise you a half-chewed ostrich bone. At least I bought fun band-aids last week. Oh, ouch. That is... Why do you have that? My AC exploded on a record-breaking heat wave in Oregon. Oh my god. That is... That... Man, technology is a little, um... Scary sometimes. A spider decided that I should be the next Spider-Man and jumped to my face. Fell hands first to marble flooring from 14 feet. Ouch. Well, uh, at least it didn't bite you, right? Uh, if it did, maybe you, I don't know, you'd get like super healing or something. Recently moved. Put a wooden spoon on top so it wouldn't overboil. Not really used to a gas slash open flame stove yet. I mean, at least you didn't burn down the house. My kids and I spent the weekend making a snow penguin. This is the penguin finally done at 9.30 a.m. And then the penguin at 4.30 p.m. He's had a rough day. Oh man, it went from a happy penguin to, oh gosh, I'm suffering. The guy who hit the car didn't leave a note, but my mom got his license plate and left a note. Ooh, that, that's not good. But kudos to your mom for being a good person. This is Southeast Queensland, Australia after major rain and flooding. You go on maps trying to figure out which roads to take? Ha, joke's on you, buddy. None of them. Everything shut down. Was eating this fantastic chicken parm I made when I got a knock on the door and I tripped over a laptop cable, which led to an unfortunate sequence of events resulting in this. Yo, whoever was at that door better have had a good reason to knock, because look at what they call 
just turned my 2DS on to this this morning. Oh, I wonder what file corruption occurred is. I don't think I played that game. Looks fun though. I hit a pothole on the interstate going 55 miles per hour, took out both right side tires, took out four other cars while I was there for three hours, called the authorities and they called me a tow truck. One five minute drive later and I now owe $1,490. Aw, oh, come on, you shouldn't have to pay that. That's an accident waiting to happen. I think it's broken. Oh yeah, I mean, if you look really, really close, I think you can kind of see a break. You might miss it though. Spent half an hour scraping snow and ice off my work van this morning, only for a four by four chunk of ice to fly off a vehicle in front of me and smash my windshield less than an hour later. Everyone was okay. Yeah, everyone but the car, jeez. <laughs> That, that's terrible. When two months salary gets delayed and you've run out of everything, no money for groceries, this is what I've been having every day. You wake up in the morning like, oh yay, another nutritious day of rice and tomatoes. <laughs> God, I need money. Oh, now this picture just represents all anger. This <laughs> I feel so sorry for you. So mate, how bad was the flooding in Jinpai last week? He sent me this. Yeah, I I'm gonna guess that the flooding was pretty bad. My friend tracked his AirPods to the local dump. Well, looks like it's time to go dumpster diving. Guess which one looked more like the coffee jar as I was waking up? Oh, I see their mistake. Although to be fair, gold blended coffee mix is good, but Bisto's gravy, come on, that's gonna wake you up. Had vodka delivered. It still has the security tag on it, so I can't open it. Hey, well now you got a cool looking decoration piece, right? No? <laughs> Yeah, no, that sucks. Stepped outside and slipped on ice. Dislocated and broke several bones in my ankle. Ha, <laughs> nice. Tried to refill my little Tabasco bottle from the gallon jug. Well, did it work? Consequences of working in a negative 10 degrees Celsius lab where I have to wash my hands 40 times a day. Now sure, your hands might be dry and unmoisturized, but I bet those are the cleanest hands in the world. <laughs> rip clean car. Not only that, but rip your wallet. That's like $30 worth of Starbucks. Someone pried the BMW emblem off my car. What? Wait, <laughs> wait, you can do that? <laughs> You can tell it sucks by the way it is. Jeez, that nail just straight up assassinated your tire. Yeah, no, that's not road safe. Tag on the shirt my mom is wearing. Warning, may cause cancer or reproductive harm. Wait a second, what the heck are they making the shirts out of? Uranium? This is ridiculous. My girlfriend spent hours making me dinner and the lid exploded. No, 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 just keep the glass in there. It gives the meal a nice healthy crunch. Why would you buy groceries when you can grow your own? And before you make fun of the size of the banana, let me just remind you, it's not the size that matters. And for a lot of people, that's an average sized banana. What, you don't think that's average sized? What are you, some kind of weirdo? Stop picking on me. I mean, um, on the banana. Oh, never mind, next meme. Fell down the stairs at a ski rental house about five minutes after arriving. Broke the railing and badly hurt my right hip. Not sure if I can ski and now we will have to pay the security deposit on top of that. Property damage. You can't even enjoy your vacation. This is just, just a terrible day off. Just a terrible use of your time and money too. My crappy drink holder failed and my mocha milkshake spilled. I didn't even get to have any. Oh, come on, stop complaining. Grab a spoon or a straw and just suck it off the floor. I hate to call you a crybaby, but suck it up. And I'm not joking, I mean literally like suck it up. I mean. <laughs> Wife bought me a shirt this past Christmas that finally came in the mail. I'm a huge space nerd, but I guess I won't be wearing it anytime soon. Oh, just because it's the Soviet Union? Actually, you know, I see where you're coming from. Never mind. That makes sense. This bathroom trash can opens to the other stall. Aw, oh, now you can play peekaboo with the person sitting next to you. Hey, hey, you in there. I see you. <laughs> Just morning rush things. Not a bad grilled cheese sandwich, although next time I would probably use a lot less plastic. Spent hours painting pottery and it breaks in the kiln. I bet you if you painted dogs, it probably wouldn't have cracked. I'm just saying, I'm just saying. Gasoline prices today at the highway in the Netherlands. That's $8.85 per gallon. And just like that, I'm walking. Saw someone else's deformed foot and I would like to showcase my curvy mess. Oh gosh. Yo, why is your foot a whole cartoon character? I don't think they fit. No, no, we fit, I swear. All that's left to do is just input that John Cena meme. Are you sure about that? Are you sure about that? ATM shut down with my card still inside. Ha ha, it is my money now, loser. Get wrecked, ha ha. I think someone let their anger out on my car. What gave it away? Was it the footprints or the giant dent? You know, maybe it's both. Was so ready to eat and then this happened. Yo, that's even, that's like 40 
bucks worth of Chipotle. You better use that vacuum in the bottom left corner and just eat out of the vacuum bag, cause that food can't be going to waste. Bought fried chicken at airport. Then as I was boarding, the bag ripped from the bottom side and the box landed upright at first, but then it ripped in the same manner when I picked it up. The universe just said, N -n -n, no chicken for you. All right, you're gonna enjoy this flight with no food at all. How tragic. When you forget your gloves on a cold windy day, ah, good morning breeze and four cases of frostbite. It's probably not gonna be a good day for you. If this happens to you, you can kind of just assume that the day is probably not gonna be a good day. Someone's car alarm has been ringing through the night for weeks. I saw this today. Fix your alarm, you screw up. <laughs> I'm surprised this car isn't even more vandalized. Honestly, this is a pretty nice message. If it's been going off for weeks, I thought it would have been like the other car with a bunch of foot marks and dents. Honestly, this car deserves it. Florida man, fed up with watching cell phone usage while people were driving, is fined $48,000 for jamming cell phones while driving. Probably one of the few people to ever be pulled over by the FCC. Okay, so obviously what this guy was doing is illegal, but he was getting people off of their cell phones while driving, so is he really a bad guy? Always thought my foot hurts because I I'm fat. Turns out my foot is just deformed. Really? For your whole life you just thought this was normal? You thought Jimmy Neutron's forehead was just resting in the heel of your foot and it was just fine? Your heel looks pregnant. I'm talking third trimester. Like, I, your foot's probably pregnant with Mega Mind in it. Like, what, what the heck is this? Stubbed my toe yesterday. Hurt this morning when I put my shoes on. Took my shoes off this evening and found this. Yep. Okay, that looks painful. Melon beats knife. I mean, <laughs> nature always wins in the end, my dude, and let's just say watermelon can fight back. First snow of the season. Ah, as a fellow 97 Honda driver, I feel your pain, my dude. Except mine doesn't have a sunroof, so <laughs> that's what you get for having luxury, baby. Cats one, tree zero. You just know the cat is super pleased about its work here. I mean, look at that evil long whisker. It's evil, man. My coffee was cold, so I microwaved it. I've had this mug for four years and never looked at the bottom, I guess. Aw, oh, dude, that's a bummer when that stuff is dishwasher safe but not microwave safe. How else am I supposed to drink my hot cocoa? Waited two hours for this. Pizza or bread bowl? Thanks, Domino's. The real answer is garbage. That's what all Domino's pizza is. It's gross. Don't order from Domino's. <laughs> Seriously. Can't knock my iPad off disc. And uh, let's just say it's a little bit broken. Just a little bit. Just needs a little bit of elbow grease. Good to go. Cutting up broccoli. I found this little dude. Sadly, we ate the broccoli before. Ew, that's so gross, dude. That's fine. I don't really need to see anyways. Yeah, everyone knows glasses are optional for people like us. We don't need them to see or contacts. My coworker rigged a catalytic converter burglary alarm with a decibel range louder than a building fire alarm in my office. The sensor triggered when I sat down at my desk at 6 a.m. Um, I got an idea. Here's how you fix that. You see the wires that are plugged into the battery? Rip them off. It's that simple. Went to an arcade for friend's birthday. Should have stayed home. I mean, dude, just go to the game, people. They will definitely fish that out. You won it fair and square. It's not your fault it doesn't fit down the hole. Spend 60 dollars on a new headlight and it blew don't know if i hit the tip or got a crappy bulb i didn't touch the bulb sure you didn't sure you didn't touch the bulb you also need to put on the bulb grease my dude probably not the free product placement you who wanted i mean all publicity is good publicity <laughs> not really keep well clear of power boat rices why I mean, oh, that's why I thought the boat was cutting it. No, it's straight up jammed into the front of that yacht. I think that's a yacht at least, or at least it's a big boat. My office apparently has mice. Nah, dude, that's just your coworkers pretending to be mice so they can nibble on your snackies. Entered the diaper genie bag, but no one noticed. Ooh, woof, dude. Uh, that's why kids are gross. Yuck, no thanks. Went to get gloves. Some sale. Yeah, the sale is they're more expensive. Thanks, holidays. Cutting up some cauliflower and found this. Lost my appetite and developed a new fear. Mmm, spider cauliflower, my favorite. 16 years of life and I finally broke my first bone playing hockey. Twas my wrist. I mean, that's what happens when you play hockey. Hockey is like a full contact sport, my dude. Words can't describe my sadness. How? How did this happen? How did one slice burn? Please tell me, were you cooking two pizzas at once? I chipped my tooth. As someone who has also chipped their tooth, let me tell you, it hurts and it's never gonna be fixed quite right. Was awoken at 4.30 in the morning by some ruckus in the kitchen and found that the cats had reorganized our snack cabinet. Reorganized, no. Ransacked, yes please. Also, why were they eating like leggy charms? Cats don't really even like that, do they? This well 
sucks. Nah, nah, dude. It, wells don't suck. Your mother does. Oh! Okay, that's enough of that joke. Drove the long way home to avoid my big hill since my car's old. 99 Corolla. Only to get stuck in my driveway. Got home safe. Got stuck trying to pull in. I mean, drive faster? I don't know. It's a 99 Honda, man. That thing will eat the snow. My toddler found my Cintiq pen and completely took it apart. Rip, dude. Um, keep your Wacom away from your toddlers. What can I say? Don't, don't leave it on the floor. Someone hit my parked car and drove off. I'm really sorry, dude. That sucks. Um, maybe hope they have security cameras? <laughs> my dog ate my Apple Pencil. This is, uh, this is just awesome. Thanks, Papo. Love you so much. My friend Jack's parents also gave him the middle name Russell. <laughs> Jack Russell. <laughs> Sucks to be this dude. Storm drain cloggage on my street the day a year it rains in California. Bro, that's just, that's legit California. They don't have storm drains anywhere because it doesn't rain. And when it does rain, people wreck their cars 24-7. Dad dropped his cane. <laughs> I mean, I don't think he's getting it. <laughs> that lives down there forever. It's the alligator's property now. Well, this was a first. The single light is placed behind the pole. Hmm. Um, I guess it glows bright enough, so you should be fine. Also, this whole intersection looks like a mess. In the USA, bought a cool thin Sony Blu-ray player at thrift store, super cheap. Then I saw the cord. Oh, that's why. Yeah, that kind of sucks. Halloween edition Pokemon card found mangled under recliner. Not sure how it got there. Was in my backpack. I mean... It's it, it's a Halloween edition, but like that's not a super rare one, so I guess that's fine. I think they're done. Nah, they're not done. Give them a few more minutes on the uh, stovey. They need to be nice and crunchy for the corn doggies. Someone left a potato in the microwave that I clean every night. It was still warm. Hmm. Interesting. Um, huh. Is that an office or something? There goes my Jeep. Woof, dude. I mean, I thought it was going to be rolled over because, you know, Jeeps just love to roll, especially Cherokees. But like, yikes, dude. Uh, maybe maybe check the undercarriage before buying it. That's really rusty. Was at the stoplight at an underpass and suddenly my back window shattered. There goes my crit's Christmas money. Yes. Yeah, sorry. Also, is that a pentagram on your window? <laughs> maybe it was God striking your window down. Went over a train track bump and my bike rack popped off. Top part with the foam pads. Bike got dragged for two blocks before I could safely pull over, and it's raining. Yeah, I don't think that bike is too salvageable there, buddy. <laughs> bike racks always ruin your bikes. Am I the only one that thinks that? Friend can't catch a break. Tree fell on friend's house, broke beams in attic. Oof. I mean, shouldn't leave a tree that tall close to your house? I don't know what to say. Classmate decided to drop our full backpacks in a trash bag for a scene we were filming. Guess whose was on the bottom? Yeah, I mean, if, if like you were part of it, that's on you for not taking your laptop out. But if like your friends or classmates picked it up and did it without your permission, they need to buy you a new laptop. Leaving for work in the morning for this little surprise. Oh, thanks, kitty cat. Thanks for peeping right on my rug. Hopefully the police caught the spider. Man killing spider burns down home. Yeah, that, uh, that spider man really is an arsonist these days. Notice the toilet paper after I sat down. So stand up. Like, if you notice it the second you sat down, stand up before you start pooping and pull your pants up a little. It's not that big of a deal. Moved six years worth of documents and photos from my unusable computer onto a flash drive only for it to corrupt the moment I plug it into my new computer after five hours of trying to repair and recover. Only option was to format it in entirely. Yay! Flash drives ruin everything! I totally didn't lose my entire, you know, demo reel and modeling portfolio to one. <laughs> you have never known true defeat until you have to fix this. Yeah, both the plunger and the toilet. Also, can you put the pooping seat up? I don't know what that's called, but like you're getting the gross water all over it, dude. Drop my phone at the perfect moment for a 14 wheeler to pass by. Nice, nice. That thing's definitely usable. Not gonna slit your throat while holding up to your face. <laughs> Got to work, brewed coffee, and then dropped my favorite mug. I just wanted a cup of coffee. I mean, <laughs> I like this comic artist also, so I follow him. I, I always wanted this mug, but I was too poor to afford it when it came out. But uh, at least the mug speaks the truth. Lost my wallet with a hundred bucks ID and air tag in it. Didn't realize it until it was too late. Apparently, it's in the middle of the street, miles from my home. So drive, drive back to it. At least it's still there, dude. <laughs> you know where it is. Stop complaining. Forced me to make an account to fully use my new headset. Yay! I love having to give away my personal information to use a product I already paid for. Asked the seller if they could add Tilt Watch to the crate. They asked for a reference picture, printed it out on a piece of paper, and taped it on. Yeah. 
Awesome, thanks. Yeah, that paintbrush lives in there now. There's no getting it back. It's gone forever, buddy. Got six copies of the same 4x6 print. They arrived like this, have ordered multiple prints for, and they came in one envelope. So obviously a glitch. I mean... <laughs> <laughs> Hooray, we don't need a planet anyways. Jeff Bezos is gonna fly away to a different planet when it dies. Sprinkles are the best part. Yeah. Yeah, they are. This cosmic brownie's ruined. But I want to see the other side of this cosmic brownie. I have a feeling one got on the bottom and they took this photo for internet points. Opened my bag of bitong today and was immediately greeted with a weird smell. Guess the moisture packet failed me. At least I'm not hungry anymore. For anyone else that was super confused what bitong is before we get to the moldy food, it's like dried meat from South Africa. So you learn something new every day. And also, mmm, extra protein, am I right? Ha <laughs> ha, fence put up two weeks ago. <laughs> I guess the environment had other plans. I had to hitchhike 50km home after a 12km walk because of a screw. Oof, that uh, that really sucks my dude. Um, maybe carry a spare tire if you're going on a road trip? Our kitty broke her leg and had to have surgery right before the holidays. <laughs> got a little cone on. She looks stressed, but also it's a really pretty kitty. Anyways, have a good one everyone. Stay safe and stay healthy.